before I even get into this video, don't mind how I look because listen, I wasn't about to do my hair, put on eyelashes, just for me to sit back down in the bed and watch TV and you know what I'm saying. I'm not doing that. Y'all know, and if y'all don't know, I'm me to the fullest and I'm not changing it for nobody. So I don't see how people get done up to just stay in the house. It, it doesn't make sense to me. So I'm coming to the camera as raw as I can, as raw and uncut as I can, me all the way, sweetie. So before we start this video, yes, I have a bonnet on. Yes, I got a t-shirt on. <laughs> Take it or leave it. So if you don't like how I look, there's plenty of other YouTubers to watch. And sweetie, I won't be mad. I will very much be glad. But anyways, let's get right into this video. <laughs> YouTube guys I'm back again with another video it has been a very long time it's been about three to four months and it's very much needed <laughs> everything happens for a reason you know and I had I couldn't be on here because you know I found something out that I was afraid to tell you guys and I really didn't feel like there was anybody's business I still feel like it ain't anybody's business, but it's y'all business because this channel is my life. And like I said, this is what I wanted to do. But I wanted to wait until I was ready to actually um, let y'all know in the most humblest way ever with my rhyme, my, excuse me, with my mind right. And again, you guys, I have something to tell you guys, and I'm excited. I'm happy. This is a new chapter in my life where it's all about my family. And I'm not talking about the ones I was born into because, like I said, yeah. Not talking about the ones I was born into, but my own family, yes. I know, I'm saying my own family, yes. And I'm announcing to you guys that I am pregnant. Yes, 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 yes. I am pregnant. I am currently four months pregnant. If you want me to be technical, I'm four weeks and six days pregnant. And I'll show you guys my little two, my 2D two right here. My little baby. But yes, you guys, I am pregnant. I am pregnant. I am pregnant. And that's why I haven't been on here because I've been making sure I'm straight. I've been making sure, you know, everything that I'm planning to do from this, should I say, from the time I found out and on has really just been all about my child and nothing else matters like I'm just completely focused on my family my baby's health my relationship make sure my relationship is healthy and just you know being happy I guess I'm extremely excited um, I can't really fully express to you guys how excited I am. Anybody who knew me, who was around me, because nobody's around me now, but anybody who was around me knows I love kids. I love kids to the max. Anybody, any friend that had any siblings know, any friend that had nieces and nephews know, I love kids. Any type of kid that's around me, I play with them, I'll 
sit and watch their shows, whatever they want to watch. Like, I'm just a total kid at heart. I love kids. I feel like they're the sweetest things on this earth. And the only reason why they grow up to be nasty is because of the environments that they're around. But I love kids to the max. And the fact that I'm able to bring my own kid into the world is just mind-blowing to me. I'm still getting used to it because, trust me, me saying that I'm pregnant now is like, wow, I'm pregnant. Like, it's, it's definitely something to get used to because, like, nobody, especially if you're having your first child, it's like, yeah, I'm not, I'm not used to this. Like, it's something different to be like, oh, yeah, I'm pregnant. Like, that, that, that right there is just, it's hitting different. Like, it's just, you're not living for yourself anymore. You're living for somebody else. You have somebody else looking after you. Every step that you take, every thing that you do, you have somebody watching you. Somebody watching how you treat them. It's just completely different. And if I was to be very honest with you guys, when I found out I was pregnant, I was happy. I was, of course, I was like happy. But during the time I was pregnant, I was having like a little ups and downs in my relationship. And to be honest, I didn't, I wasn't even really sure if I wanted to be in my relationship anymore because of our ups and downs. And, you know, not saying our relationship, it don't matter who you with, you're going to have ups and downs. Trust me, with money, without money, whatever you do to yourself, you're going to have ups and downs. Like, it don't matter what you do, what possibility you take, what role you go down, you're going to have ups and downs. And that's just factual. And I just feel like, you know, once I got pregnant, my whole life took a 180. And it really did. Like, things are not perfect because nothing is ever perfect. But I feel like things have gone forward for the better. And I'm just happy as heck. Because I get to have a family that... I, whatever I wished for, for my family, I could sculpt that and build it into my own life. Because I'm, I, I, whatever I say goes for my family. Well, I gotta run it by my, you know, my boyfriend. But, you know what I'm saying? For the majority of the time, whatever I say that I want or how I want things to go, it's gonna go for my family. And I'm just, extremely grateful you know i get asked a lot oh do i regret getting pregnant during this time or do i feel like you know um it's a little bit too early because you know i don't have this and that and this and that and it's just like god doesn't make mistakes but you know at the timing of the blessings he gives you and all this is for me, it's just fire under my behind to get things straight before my baby gets here. Cause my baby is due like March, April. My due date is in April. And I just want things all the way set for my baby when my baby comes. Like, don't even like, how I am now, don't even speak on my child. Like, I'm just on that type of time and like, That's another thing I'm always like. Tight. Yeah, I'm gonna see me yawn probably a couple of times in this video. If you don't, <laughs> thank you. But if y'all do, I'll let y'all know in advance. But I don't know how to put it. Like, I've just. Life has really just opened my eyes to a lot. You know, for the past couple of years, I've been losing, like, down, like I said, down to my grandmother, to all of my friends, really. I don't speak to nobody because I don't have the urge to speak to nobody about nothing. Like, especially if it's on some, like, petty stuff, I, I, don't, I don't have the urge or even have the urge to have friendships anymore because it's just not for me. 
you know, I've always been a person that loved people around me, you know, loved, you know, to help somebody if they need help. And it's just, what I told you? And my eyes get teary too, so don't mind me, I'm not crying, I'm just, you know. But, you know, I used to love having people around me 24 seven, going out, having a good time. And I'm just a completely different person now. Like, I'm just all about my relationship and getting things right. And now I'm just all about my family. Because that's what it's about now. My family. It's not nothing. If you ain't talking about business, business ventures, generational wealth, good ideas, something we can do to help people other than ourselves. I have nothing to talk about. I don't have time for all the extra stuff that comes with life. Like I said, life is always going to have ups and downs. You're always going to go through stuff. But if I can help it myself, I'm going to live my life drama free. Like I just don't, I don't have the time to be worrying about grown people no more like this is not about grown people no more it's about my child that's not grown very much a baby so yeah i'm just completely excited and i'm blessed because a baby is a blessing you know two years ago i was worrying about i just found out i have pcos and i was worrying about if i was going to even be able to have a baby and now two years later, I'm having a baby. I'm four months pregnant. So I'm extremely blessed. And you know, a lot of females don't even get the chance to have a baby naturally in their own body. You know what I'm saying? Or even have to be, have a baby at all because you're not fertile. So it's just, it's, it's really a blessing and then I'm really just speechless because every time I talk about that I actually cry and I don't want to cry on this video even though it's normal because like I said I'm going to be me regardless but it's really just a blessing and I just can't thank God enough for blessing my life and giving me a major purpose now which is my child Him, I do. Puppy. Obviously. But yeah, you guys, back to what I was saying. I'm sorry for the interruption. You know, my mama was coming. But yeah, I don't know how to physically. <laughs> you wanna play? I don't know how much I can physically say. Get it to you. Get it to you. words but I'm extremely grateful and I promise to always love my child no matter what be on their by their side no matter what always have a listening ear for anything that's going on in their life because I want to make sure that I'm always the first person they know they can call no matter what the situation is no matter how I would react I want them to always feel comfortable talking to me first or their dad before anybody else. And I just want to be there completely for my child, all areas, no areas missed. And I'm just extremely grateful for the love that I'm about to receive in a couple of months. And, you know, knowing that it's not no fake love, it's not no love that's just going to last for a couple of years then it's gone it's an everlasting love with my child and that's something i actually prayed for that's something that i actually you know wanted in my life even though my child's father is amazing i love him to death like i said throughout our ups and downs he's just an amazing person he's my best friend and i'm just happy that i'm having a child with my best friend and we can just you know be how we want to be and unapologetically 
and love on a child. And I'm gonna be very honest, once my child get here, my child is not gonna be on YouTube like that because I don't like people. So, and the comments and the trolling, I don't do too well with that. I'm working on it though, but I don't do too well with it. So y'all won't be seeing my child like that, but y'all will be seeing my child, but just not often because Grown people don't be acting like grown people. Grown people be acting like kids. And I don't, I'm not too fond of that. But I really just wanted to come on here and let you guys know what's been going on. What's been, you know, why I've been missing for three months. And it's, you know, since it's finally said and done, I can, you know, do me and... <laughs> I, I can't say I, I've been really hiding because, you know, I don't post like that. Well, I'm going to be posting on here because I'm definitely posting again tomorrow on my first week of being pregnant to like week seven, week eight. Let y'all know everything that happened in the very beginning of my pregnancy because it's a whole lot, a whole lot I can tell y'all. But I don't be posting on Instagram and stuff like that, but I will be getting my followers up down below you know, follow that Instagram that y'all see on the screen down below. I will add my TikTok in here too because I'm going to be adding myself more on TikTok because I love TikTok low-key. That's like one of my, that is probably like my favorite app. TikTok is lit and it's just mad fun. You don't see no negativity, nothing. It's just fun. Everybody doing challenges, funny things. like. So y'all yeah, probably see me on TikTok. So follow my TikTok right here. And you guys... I love you guys and I'm back. And I think I'll show y'all my belly just a little bit. Yeah, let me get up. Let me show y'all. Hold on. You know, I know it's not much. You know, I hear every day I've been really gain weight like that, but this is my belly for right now. You know, it's not you see it. It's a little something something there, but it's not, you know, huge or nothing like that. Like I said, I'm four months. Ain't nothing big, ain't nothing special. And I have another business coming out, y'all. Another business venture. I'm gonna let y'all know when that gets started so y'all can look out for that too. And look out for all the stuff with that. I will let you guys know that when that gets started because that's gonna started very soon. But MA family, I love you guys to the fullest. And I'm happy I actually bring this out to y'all now because now I can start back posting and <laughs> It's lit. And like I said, if I come back on this camera tomorrow with this bonnet, that means I don't got time to be putting nothing on. Because like I said, I can't say if y'all was pregnant, y'all would know because everybody feel differently when they're pregnant. But if anybody feels like me when half of the time you don't want to do nothing or put nothing on, you know, put it on. You know what I mean? Just, you know, chill, relax, <laughs> and do what it do. And whatever I put out, I put out, and you better love it. But I appreciate you guys and my family. I love you guys. Like I said, follow my social media, my TikTok, my Instagram. It's probably going to pop up again right down below. So please do that. Go, go do that. And please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And then my family, I'm out. And I'm back.